Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's time for the Wake Up Nigeria Kitchen to come alive. And what better way to do that than with an amazing meal. Now, we are set to produce something sweet today. We have some amazing ingredients right here with us, and we're going to be displaying them on the screen in a little while. How you doing, Chef? I'm good. I'm just trying to bring out the pans for you. What pan are we going to be using today? A plastic pan, the fine, the fry pan is fine. The frying pan. The frying pan. All right, fantastic. Yes. So let's start with what we're making today. What are we creating today? Yeah, today we are making mm -hmm. plantain. Go ahead. Okay, plantain, mm -hmm. egg, chicken burrito. Plantain and egg, chicken burrito. Yeah. Chicken burrito. Yeah. So you need to explain what a burrito is for yeah, me. Yeah, burrito is one of the Mexican. Is their own way of making sandwich. Okay, a is Mexican a, sandwich. Yeah, is a wrap. <laughs> okay, all right. But not like the shawarma, no. <laughs> okay, so is is it shawarma bread where you? No, using? no, no. This is tortilla bread. Tortilla. Okay, yes. so um, what's the difference between a tortilla and a shawarma bread now? Can you yeah, tell me? The difference between tortilla bread and shawarma bread is just simple. So when you are making shawarma bread, mm. you make use of yeast. Oh, okay. Which take longer. You know, when you have anything that is using yeast, you yes. have to allow it to prove. Okay, but in okay. this tortilla, when you are making tortilla, all you need is just oh. baking powder. So you don't need okay. to allow it to prove. So it's a quick way of okay. making flat bread. So this is a very flat bread. It doesn't have, you don't, you don't separate it. No, no, you don't separate Or anything like you that. Don't it's also a little bit uh, softer than exactly, the than shawarma, shawarma bread. bread. Okay, yeah. so this is a tortilla. Nice All right, so at this point, I'm going to bring out one of the pans. So you need to tell us what the first thing we're going to be doing is. Okay. What's the first thing we're going to yeah, do? The first thing is just to fry our plantain. Okay. After the plantain, then I start working on the chicken. Okay. So the chicken, we are only going to pan grill the chicken. We are not frying it. All right. So let's get to work. Um, so the plantain, I think we need a chopping board for this yeah, one. Yeah, need a chopping board. Let for me that. get the chopping board for All you. Right. Is, let's go through the ingredients while we begin uh, getting our plantain the right way. Okay, All right. Yeah, the pan's okay. on heat already. I think we need a second pan for the chicken as well. Okay. All right. No problem. I'll get that out for you. All right. Thank so you. now the ingredients are going to show up on your screen. Make sure you check out uh, what you have in your fridge, in your cupboard, and see if you can get them. Well, you know what? We have some eggs. We have plantain. We have onions. We have green peppers. We also have tomatoes and avocado. You need to tell me what we're going to be doing with the avocado. Yeah, the avocado. Mm -hmm. So we just to cut the avocado, the tomato. Okay. Then the spinach. We are going to saute the spinach. Hmm. Okay. So saute simply means quick frying method in a little. Amount oil. of oil, yeah. Okay, saute. So you are not deep frying. All right. The avocado looks nice and firm. How do you select yours? I've always wondered yeah, how you select your like avocado. Like when I'm selecting avocado, mm. I look for the. Don't buy the one that is the skin is already looking too dark. Okay. So and for you to know the avocado is right. So once you just press it a mm. bit, once it's mm. so you get to know that this is. Okay. The type okay. of avocado you are looking okay. for. Okay. All right. All right. All right. No problem at all. So all the, right. So the plantain, we are going to dice mm -hmm. the plantain. Go ahead. All right. All right. So this Just, is a... And it's dry plantain. You know, we are missing everything inside the wrap, so... You want it to be very ripe. Yes. Fantastic. But if you don't like the ripe plantain, you can make use of maybe normal ripe or half ripe. It Fantastic. all depends on the person's choice. Fabulous. For me, I prefer using ripe plantain. All right. So it looks like we still have quite a bit of work to do. Uh, are we going to be dicing the pepper and the, the onions? Pepper, everything is going to be diced. Everything is going to be diced. Yes. Avocado is going into this as well. Yes. I, I'm trying to imagine how these flavors are going to come together, but I know you've got our back. At this point, we're going to be handing it over to Mike, and there's a Conversation. Welcome back, and we're in the kitchen with Chef Addex. Now, Chef Addex is putting together a chicken and plantain burrito, right? 
Yes. Fantastic, I got it right. Uh, now, a lot of great ingredients here, very colorful display, I have to say. We've already uh, diced the plantain, and that's frying right now. It's diced a lot smaller than people are used to. Is there a reason why you made it so small? Yeah, because it's already, we are going to wrap everything together, so there is no point. But if you want, you can also shred it, dice it long. Okay. okay. It okay. all depends on your choice, but I prefer to do it that way. So our chicken breast is ready. Now, what are we doing uh, with the chicken breast right now? Uh, the chicken breast, all we need to do is just season the chicken breast. This is our salt. Go ahead. Go ahead. So salt. Yes. Yeah, straight onto the chicken breast right there. Then the black pepper. Okay, ground black pepper. So this is our yaji spice. Yaji, like yeah. uh, suya spice? Yaji? Yeah, yeah that is suya spice. All right. We just spread generously front and back on this mm. side. This is smoked paprika. Oh, okay. This is Spanish spice. So with all these spices now, the chicken is prepared to go into the pan, yes? Yes, yeah, so all you need to do is just massage, mm. like rub everything so that you... Although normally you are supposed to marinate mm. maybe for two hours, mm. or if you have time, you can marinate overnight so that the spices can penetrate okay. and make it more tasty. Okay, okay. But That's since we don't have enough time, you can just oh. quickly grill. Okay. So... So all you need to just add a little bit of our pan is already hot. Yeah. So you, is that olive oil or vegetable oil? No, this is vegetable oil. All right. This. So skin side down. Yes. Mm -hmm. so, nice. Fantastic. So now with the pan that hot, it means that the chicken is going to start searing. Searing. Yeah, yeah they say quick. that the skin is going to be brown. Fantastic. The plantain is also well on Our its way. Our plantain is ready. So what do we do now? What do we do next? Yeah, so after the plantain, just to start dicing the... Tomatoes. The green pepper, tomato, avocado, then we combine everything together, add the lemon juice. Then okay. I'll just saute the spinach. Then after right. sauteing the spinach, we start making the scrambled eggs. So All right. It's nothing too serious. So we're waiting on the chicken to saute right now, skin side down. Hopefully you're making a version of this yourself. If you are, just make sure you send us a video. Use our hashtag Wake Up Night on TVC. This is the we have to head over to Mike Messikeno now because there was a lot that happened in the world of sports over the weekend. Take a seat, take a seat. Thank you so much All for right. joining us on the show today. Thank you. Now, you have the opportunity to taste something from the one and only Chef Alex. Now, he is amazing. As you can see, look at what he's put together. Look, and he has a special salsa. What's salsa. in the salsa again? No, no, this is a sauce. A sauce, rather. No, most sauce. Wraps, mm. People prefer using mayonnaise. That is the most common one. Yeah. But this one I'm making the healthy wrap with okay. zero calories. Okay. So I decided to come up with this my own sauce. Okay, what's in the sauce? What goes yeah, in it? It is made of fresh roux dough, okay. tatache. Wow. Then, so you just make it like normal stew with mm. little olive oil, garlic and ginger. So once it's ready, you put it in a blender and blend. So it's also known as puree. Pureed. So, and I think you said you added uh, yeah, yogurt. Yeah, added inside? Greek yogurt mm -hmm. and a bit of honey. So That's you need to have a taste of that, That's please. Organic. I don't even know where do yeah. I, how do I just, start? Just pick it up. Just pick you it up. Just pick, just it, pick it, up. it up. Pick it up. Okay. Pick up uh, one and just have a taste. Um, have a it's a wrap. Mm. So what do you think? Mm. What? <laughs> it's like you're in shock. You're surprised. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. It was fantastic. All right. So, uh, thank you. He wasn't expecting it to taste this good. And that's one of the things we love about Chef Addix. You know, uh, great things, small packages. Yeah, very soon. Very, very soon you'll understand a lot more about him. Check him out on social media as soon as you can. Of course, the guys are on the couch. Hopefully, there's no uh, strong uh, animosity. Happening on the couch. You don't, you don't always have to find some cheese every time. It's already too late. Just he does have animosity be. against Just Will let Smith. it be. <laughs> Give and us what a word of wisdom. Let's go home. When no, someone Will Smith. slap like that, what do you say? They smack the wisdom out of Chris Rock. <laughs> 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 but this is not a laughing matter. I know a number of people have come against me. This is not a laughing matter. Mm. Just see. 
But when you're you talking, be careful. <laughs> because sometimes now, that slap now has affected Chris Rock's future career. Oh, <laughs> no. No, I disagree. But. I disagree. Okay. We're going to have then, this conversation but then, tomorrow. But, then, but, then, but, then, but that was wrong. Whichever way, man, you can defend your lady with honor. I agree with that. Yes. All right. Not, not, the, not the Will Smith way. Yeah, <laughs> you can do it with honor. All but right. Please, I'm going to have to slap you. Joke, <laughs> See you guys tomorrow, man. So, Thank you very much. Yeah. Again. So, uh, just like how Chris Rock took it, you can take it like a G. Cheese! Cheese! Have a great Cheese! day. Cheese! We're done! Bye! Cheese! <laughs>